there trying to get rid of the white hello YouTube welcome to the rod and reel fix it shop might as well be uh, this is an old rod I had uh, 1989 I'll snap a picture at 404 Zepco it's just like new inside it is I greased up I even mean, is they're cheap made but this one's really good shape okay this is an old rod that was broke okay here was the diameter and this is the top of the rod I can't tell you if it was two piece or not okay and I had chopped this down uh, it was about four foot long well we took some more off it we took like this much off I don't know if you can see it on the camera a real ugly yellow set it yellow it's ugly yellow to me so that's what size it went to it went from this down to here and then of course you went up to the smaller diameter what we did was wrap some foil tape around the rod about here and it goes about this part put some masking tape and we put a lot of epoxy in there because we knew it would soak in the masking tape shove that in there let it cure overnight and we didn't like the yellow rod the top was all yellow so took some flat black first we sprayed the eyelets and sprayed here and then we took some dark camo oh, I don't take a picture it's uh, forest green I'll snap a picture of that and we just sprayed it on it we did mask down here we just sprayed it on there it overlaps into the black there's only a two and a half foot rod now so we're gonna use this for catching bluegill these were rusty I would scraped them up you know or clean off with sandpaper you know sprayed over all the whatever they call that you wrap around there somebody give me the name of that stuff what's that called when you wrap that around there but uh, we did paint this black again this was rusty we cleaned it up and painted it in your little hold down and we got the idea for the green because this looks kind of camo kind of a camo looking and this kind of goes well with this now the shiny silver handle I would have left the silver would have been better shape but that's just cheap dollar store uh, this brand not dollar store just that brand cheapy at the big box stores which is pretty good flat black paint so it may peel off because it's on plastic but there you go we'll snap some photos of this this will be a real short video on this project uh, we'll try to get one lengthway so you can see what it looks like standing up so thanks for watching this little custom rod I made just for catching bluegills who knows what I could hook into uh, it's probably got about 10 pound line on it so thanks again for watching